The Beast. The following contest is a fatal four-way Extreme Rules match. And is for the WWE Universal and the introducing the champion from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds. He is the WWE Universal Champion. The most decorated champion, combat athlete Brock in history. Lesner. Brock Lesnar is hazardous to your health. I felt the wrath of Brock Lesnar. You don't want to get in the ring with this man. You don't want to get in the ring with him. You don't want to get in the cage with him. You don't want to eat breakfast with him. Brock Lesnar will hurt you wherever he's at. I'm trying not to make eye contact with him. The most decorated combat athlete in the world. And here is the big dog. And his opponent, first, from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, he is the WWE Universal Champion, Roman. Now, Roman Reigns once told me he carries his family legacy as a badge of honor that fuels his confidence that cannot be broken. One of the workhorses of WWE proudly feels that he carries this business on his broad shoulders and will continue to do so well into the future. Well, Roman has that swagger. Roman has that confidence. And Roman has that message to the entire roster of WWE. If you think you can stop me, try. Man, good luck with that. Go ahead, Byron, try. Uh, I'm good. But there's one guarantee, whenever Roman Reigns enters an arena, he stirs up incredible emotion within the WWE Universe. It's all about his yard. The Hall of Famer is here! And introducing the challenger from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Weighing in at 249 pounds, the Rated R Superstar, Edge. Edge has accomplished everything in his career. Yeah, Cornerstone, one of the forefathers of the tables, ladders, and chairs match. Not to mention, Byron, the important fact that he totally reeks of awesomeness. And along with Christian, the creator of the five-second pose. The ultimate opportunist. to Balor Club. And introducing 
the challenger from Bray County Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn. One of the most incredible athletes to ever step foot in WWE, Finn Balor. A bona fide superstar the world over, Finn Balor seems to get better, faster, stronger, and more dangerous every single week in WWE. A truly global superstar a phenomenon amongst the WWE Universe. Finn Balor posted on social media earlier today that Balor Club is for everyone, except Byron Saxton. I read that. In this type of match, you have to watch your back at all times. Even more so with the rated R Superstar Edge in front of its combatants. This is going to be a hard stop. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. There he goes, crashing to the floor. It's still anybody's match, Cole, but he's got to be careful not to take too much more punishment here if he wants to be the one walking away with the win. Well, this certainly escalated in a hurry. I don't think any of us expected to see him fall behind so quickly. Suplex. And Finn Balor slips out of harm's way. Extraordinary elusivity. Float over. Oh. And it went oh, 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 right to the skull. So much has been said about Finn Balor being the first WWE Universal Champion, but the challenge he overcame to gain that opportunity shouldn't be overlooked. Yeah, a week after the 2016 draft, Finn Balor's debut ushered in what was called the new era of Monday Night Raw as he beat the odds in a fatal four-way match before going on to defeat Roman Reigns. Reflecting on Finn Balor's main roster debut, Byron said they called it the first episode of the new era. I like to think it was because that was my first night commentating on Monday Night Raw, but was Finn in a fine night too? You can be so self-involved with great cheese. The rest of the WWE Universe recognizes the biggest event that night as the arrival of the extraordinary Finn Balor and the great Corey Graves. Ugh. He's making a statement here with this attack. Ooh. Many times in a fatal four-way match, we've seen superstars join forces for the moment in taking on a dominant entity. This could be someone like Big Show, The Undertaker, Kane, and Nia Jax as examples. When a superstar has that type of power and can be that dominant... Byron, I think Finn Balor's due for a little target practice. Oh, you're not lying. Here he comes! Oh, almost through the turnbuckle. Oh, it's over. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture.
pressure on these superstars. It is cold. Unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury, sometimes serious injury. And there's the reversal from Finn Balor. And Edge set him up. The Impaler DDT. He might just win this thing right here. And the champ kicks out. Remarkable. To me, the most dangerous part of Finn Balor's coup de grace finisher is that Balor can crush an opponent with it from anywhere. Balor can fly from the top rope, the ring apron, heck, even off a ladder. Oh boy, he is rolling. That'll mess up the back of your neck. Look at Finn Balor stalking him. We know what's coming here. Oh boy, he is rolling. Court. Here we go. Oh, Roman Reigns saw that one coming. The Challenger's championship dreams are fading quickly. The champ. Suplex City. Just when you thought he had nothing left. And a test here for Brock Lesnar. He has to formulate a plan quickly to get things going. At this point, I don't think I like his chances of winning this throwaway match. Well, spear! That's what he was looking for, Michael. You don't perform a move like that unless you're looking to end the match. This might be it! Oh, my! What a stomp! Good grief! Here we go, Brock Lesnar is setting it up. Counter here. It's like he tapped into some unseen energy source. Ballard's got him hooked. Up and... Now back to the ring. And he's heading back in. Ooh! What a strike. The challenger looking absolutely exhausted in there. Looks like he's starting to feel the pressure of competing in this championship match. He's in tough shape, guys, and there's absolutely no room for error now. Finn Balor going high risk. Whoa! Oh, boy, he is rolling. Nailed it. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Finn Balor. Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns. Tough situation to be in right here. Yeah, you have to think this is not going to end well. The Irishman has his Irish up. Here it comes. When this guy's on, look out. Controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Man, what a slam. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Ring rattling. It's spear. The champ's in a good spot here. Even better the second time around. You gotta believe this one's over. The stop in the leg. Just after. The great ones always explode when they have the chance. Oh, uh, Roman Reigns unable to be contained. And it's Edge getting out of that one. He wants no part of the outside. Connects. It just doesn't appear to be Edge's night tonight. Oh man, Edge doesn't even know where he is. Yeah, five. Oh my. That should do it. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Set him up. Russian 
and leg sweep. Roman Reigns just too fast for him. Beautiful technique. Taking on any more damage here could very well mean the beginning of the end. We've seen this before. Got a little some harsh impact. There is no toppling the... He's on a rampage now. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. A second time. Oh, boy, he is... Ooh, what impact. Finn Balor never ceases to... Look at that. There he goes, crashing to the floor. And Finn Balor slips out of harm's way. Extraordinary elusive. A rated R superstar with a wicked spear. This is his opportunity. And he goes for the pen. Two, three. He just shut everyone up. And now Edge is our new champion. And here's another peek of the moves he saw in that match. I remember this part very well. Man, oh man, look at that. This was another great moment. And here's the last piece of the puzzle. Here is your winner and the rated R superstar, Edge. That was a big pinfall victory right there. This guy's dominance in the Fatal 4-Way match is simply undeniable. With that win in the books, we must now move on.